Utah. I should be in uh, Arizona tomorrow night, guys, camping out and um, gearing up, thinking about the Grand Canyon here. Beautiful night. Really quiet out here. Probably about a mile in off a dirt road, although the road is, like, way out there. Just make out a little piece of guardrail over there. But, uh, yeah, that's it, guys. That's the setup. I'm not planning on rain. It's cool to be camping down here so close to the 37th parallel. And if there's any UFO guys out there, you know what I'm talking about. But along the 37th parallel, there are tons of Air Force bases. And along that line are the most UFO sightings in the United States. Guaranteed tonight, definitely tomorrow night in Arizona, I will be staring at the sky. The solar panel over there, just grabbing some extra rays, charging up the Garmin. So I picked up this uh, Thermarest Neo Air X Lite in uh, Pueblo. I don't know. I was having some. I was having some pretty cold mornings. I didn't know what to expect with the Rockies. It snowed in Colorado on every pass I went over. Um, that's it, though. You know what I mean? Like I had some cold mornings and stuff like that, but um, it really wasn't all that bad. But I, I went ahead and bought this. Um, so it's like the lightest. It's the lightest blow-up sleeping pad you can get for the R value. Um, and I've definitely been having some very, very comfortable nights. Um, I picked up a uh, emergency blanket as well, but... And... There it goes. Oh. It's gonna be a pretty comfortable night here, guys. The tent stayed bone dry last night. I think it's like strictly a summer, desert, nice weather tent. I would not take that tent on the Appalachian Trail. I would not take that tent on the Appalachian Trail. Would not.
set up that solar panel right away. Oh yeah, sun's up. Woo! Just made it. God, you can feel that heat right away. Awesome. packed up here guys day 67 we are four days away from this being my longest bike tour ever not not by mileage but by days Never had a scorpion under the tent. Check that up, there's something else crazy that happens in the woods. Day 67 of the tour, day two in Utah. I'm well over 3,000 miles here, guys. Pushing into the southwestern desert of America. Love that kickstand, really. Hobbs don't play. Hobbs don't play, man. Hobbs wash Utah. Camp everywhere. Camp everywhere you would like. Man, it is just amazing out here. I am not in the Rocky Mountains anymore. Look at that. How drastic the landscape has changed. Awesome. 